Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Abelista and today you guys are going to be watching a Pedal and Pup haul. Very, very exciting. Let me just take, I know one of my friends is going to get angry at me for that. This haul is probably one of my most beautiful Pedal and Pup hauls. I got very summer inspired um, outfits. Really, really gorgeous dresses that can be for honestly any occasion. But um, very fancy uh, and I feel like very mature, like kind of things that you choose to go to like a wedding in. I've got quite a few here, so I'm going to get straight into it. My discount code is ALISTER20, let me just double check, because if you ever forget my codes, my link in my bio has all of my um, codes. Yes, ALISTER20 for 20% off, Pedal and Pop. I love Pedal and Pop, it is absolutely gorgeous. Um, I've only just started working with them, probably worked with them for like maybe three months now. Love it, it is amazing. Um, beautiful team, I've gotten really close with the person that organizes things, I've been to an event, I met everybody. They were so nice, it's, it's really nice. Just because you know everything on social media is so social media based and that's it. And you rarely actually get to meet the, the team behind the brand. That's why I got to, so I was lucky enough. I am in my apartment with Michaela and Richie. Um, you guys might know that already. But I'm going to leave all of the um, links in the description as well as the um, discount code if you guys forget. I'm also going to leave my link tree so you guys can hop on that. That'll have my discount codes but also um, my Instagram and TikTok if you want to check that out too. I've been actually really into my reels lately so um, if you go over to my Instagram, I've made a really fun reel. Well, I haven't actually made it yet. I hope it turns out good. It, actually, I'm planning on filming an Instagram and a TikTok one, and it's really, really fun. If what happens in my head works out, I'll leave a little teaser if it works out. If not, I'll be like, scrap it. I'm actually really excited. Why am I so hyped? I don't know what it is. Maybe it was the extra chocolate in my mocha today. This one is the Simonette. Simonette. Simon Simonette. I feel like I'm going to sound really dumb. It's spelled like Simonette. Simon A, Sim Simone A, anyway, dress in blue. I got this one in a size 6, um, you guys know that I usually just get size 6's because your girl is a little bit short. It fits just perfectly, I could not go any size down because it's quite tight around here, but um, I was lucky that it's got a zip. So this is an elastic, but it's got a zip, so very, very cute, um, it's got little scrunchy puffy sleeves. I think this is a perfect wedding dress. I don't know. I've never been invited to a wedding. Don't know what they're like. <laughs> if I were to go to one, if I were to go to one, I think I would wear this. I paired it with Michaela's heels. They're just these gorgeous blue ones. Um, you could do white, you could do anything. <laughs> these shoes are too big for me, but they look so cool. Anyway, yeah, it's really stunning. It's got a stretch at the back, like less like there, but it ends here and then it goes like tight. But it's kind of got like, a little bit of cleavage, but it's also like a little bit baggy. So I'm 157 centimeters, and it goes down to. I don't know if you can see. Oh yeah, I think you can just see. It goes down to midship. Normal height of people, I think it would probably go up to just below, or maybe high, high shin. <laughs> this next one is a bit of a mixed match. So I have two tops to show you it with. First, this top is the Coma top in a size six. It's a gorgeous, like really, really stretchy here, but also, what do you call this? Like a ruching, gathered kind of um, crop. This is perfect. It will honestly go with anything, but any shorts, jeans, skirts, and uh, honestly anything. Probably end up wearing this to work. I really like the look of it, and it'll be super casual. You could dress it up or dress it down. In this case, I dressed it up because um, I really wanted this skirt set. So Pedal and Pop actually sent me a set for Valentine's Day, which they called it Galentine's Day, but in my case I actually wore it to Valentine's Day with Jessie, and it was gorgeous, but um, they have come out with a yellow, which I love yellow, however they didn't have the top in my size, so I thought I would show you this top with it, um, to show you what you can pair it with, and so I actually could show you the skirt. This is the Ayla skirt in yellow, I got a size 6, I find the size 6 is honestly the perfect fit. I wouldn't go any smaller. I probably could go up in regards to this fitting, but I could. I also couldn't because of the length. Um, just for me, it's a very beautiful, ball gowny, elegant skirt. So it does go um, all the way to the ground. So I have to wear heels with it, but I wouldn't wear this kind of skirt 
if I weren't wearing heels, like it's for like really nice occasions and whatever. See, it reminds me of like the Princess Belle dress. Um, but as you can see, it is. the like lining cuts across your bottom. So if you do have a big bazonk um, just keep that in mind because this isn't stretchy. So, but I really like the look of it, how it kind of shows your whole waist. Then it flows out. I don't know. It's really, it's really different, but I think it's very, very elegant. I paired it just with some white heels. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you um, the little top that I got. So this is the um, Ayla set in multi, I'm pretty sure. Incredible. So that's the skirt. This is what made me buy the yellow one. If you can just imagine this yellow, this is the Ayla top. It is just a twist crop here. At first when I saw it, I was like, what the heck? How do I put it on? But once it's on, it actually helps. It's got little elastics here to show what obviously goes at the top to kind of hold it up. Surprisingly, it's very supportive and I didn't slip out of it or it didn't fall down or anything like that. Um, and it still looks very flattering on top. Excuse you. It's so rude sometimes. Very stretchy at the back. I'm wearing a size 6 and it is the perfect size for me. I wouldn't go up or down. Who do you think you are? Now for this sexy wedding. You've got a hot day coming up, okay? You don't know what to wear. You want to go sexy, but you want to go casual, but you kind of want to show them what you look like nude. Just going to point this out. If you're watching this for the wrong reasons, reasons, go that way. Like, I'm not kidding, but like, I'm not being sexy for anybody. I just kind of show you this sexy dress. Anyway, anyway, I just, anyway. Okay, this one is the Kiara dress in beige in a size 6. Don't know what the material is, but it is a really, really nice ribbed, um, pretty stretchy actually. It's just very, very simple, but I love how flattering it is. I usually don't go with beige kind of things like this, but oh my god, it looks stunning. My butt looks so good. I've been training a lot lately, so... I'm just going to blend it on the JD Academy. But yes, I paired it with some gorgeous, super simple beige heels. You could honestly pair this with anything. Probably black would look really nice. You can kind of see the lining. Same for a few bumps. But I love this. This is really gorgeous. This is very sexy. For pedal and pup, but in a very mature way on how they deal with things, which is really nice. And then the sexy slit as well to show off a little bit of leg. It goes down like low shin, but on normal people would probably just go down mid shin, I'm assuming. Next dress, drum roll please. This dress is the posy dress. This one um, I've already worn like four times, hence why I've lost the tag, but I got this one in a size six. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous, super casual summery springish dress very stretchy around here which i love i feel like it was very in when i was a kid so it just reminds me of when i was a kid it has like almost like ribbon like straps um not stretchy at all and it crosses over at um the back which i think is just so pretty and very elegant so it's almost backless but it's not and then it has this tie so this tie tightens this to really bring it around the rib waist I guess. I love the bow at the back. I think it's so pretty, so princess-like. And it then it's very stretchy here. So this one um, you can actually be pretty chill with the sizing. I got size 6 and it lands around my ankles. I can wear it without heels. Um, so it's really nice actually. But with this kind of thing I feel like you can go any size because it's so stretchy here. And it's so stretchy here. But just keep in mind, this isn't adjustable. So the length of this isn't adjustable. You can't tighten it because it's just those big straps. It's very, very versatile, I'd say. Versatile, size versatile, I think. You could dress this up. This would be perfect for like a picnic or something. It also has a little petticoat kind of thing underneath. So that um, ends around mid-thigh. It's just a little bit sheer, but it's a very summery thin material which is nice with the petticoat okay team this next dress is also another one that i've worn like four times i swear this one is the amazing dress in a size six 
Um, it is a shorter dress, it's quite the intricate dress. It's definitely not your usual. I probably would wear it with some blue heels, um, white heels. It doesn't look long, but it's like, it's not a mini mini, you know what I mean? It goes down just above my knees. Like, however, on normal hatchet people, I'm a little bit taller. I think it would probably go up to there. I feel like it's longer at the back, which is good. I'll show you up close. So basically, it's your normal triangle with these like move and it is stretchy here, elastic here. And the back is these gorgeous, very minimal strips. With this, um, it does mean that it's adjustable because you can tie it tighter um, and then it comes around the back. It's really, really sweet. I love the way it's designed um, with the cutouts as well. Cutouts here are very popular, but they didn't just do it in a basic, normal way. I like how they've done it with all the elastic and the string and I don't know, they really, I feel like they really put a lot of thought into this. It's not linen but it's a really really nice white, it's um, like stitching there as well, you can definitely feel it, it's like textured. Oh, I feel bad, the cat is like, he can't get comfy. Are you comfy? Um, with some beautiful blue flowers, little yellow dots and it also, this one also has a little petticoat as well. We're not flashing. Anybody, unless you're doing handstands. Last, but definitely, definitely not least, is this gorgeous white dress. It is probably the comfiest dress that I've ever worn in my life. The material is so soft, really thick, but in a good way. Um, it's this gorgeous, I, don't, I really hope that you can tell by the video just how soft it is. I don't know how to explain it, um, but it's almost like, like bed sheets, like a bed blanket, like it's so, it's that soft and then the lining as well is extremely, extremely soft. This is the perfect winter dress. I know spring it's starting to get a little bit cooler now, um, we've kind of missed a lot of our summer because of the rain. It's a very, very, very similar style to that, the Simone, Simonette dress. Um, very similar style to that, however it's a lot more stretchy. It's like the same kind of like, it's no elastic here, no elastic here, but it's just a little bit bigger, I feel like. Um, and it also has the zip all the way down, so it's a lot more luxurious, I guess. Um, but this one's obviously just the winter version because that is a much more of a thinner, um, summery material, a lot more breathable. This is stunning. I love this. I haven't seen myself in a dress like this. so. I'm very, very excited. I'm wearing a size 6. This goes down to my ankles. Um, the slit isn't too high as well, so it's still very sophisticated. I wouldn't go any bigger, just because I think this is perfect. And just, I feel like with this one, maybe go to your true size or size down. Do not size up, I think. Just because the zip is so long, so there's a lot of room for like, you know, you don't have to like squeeze into it, it goes quite long as well. You know, a dress like this you could definitely wear with some very out there heels, just because, or like very, you know, bright, like a bright pink with a bright bag, um, and a bright pink lip would be really gorgeous, maybe some red. Wow, I love this! I think that's everything as well. So I think we're leaving ending things on a really good note. Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed this haul. I'm really, really happy with all of the pieces that I chose. I think they're all absolutely stunning. And they're really good for like things that I've got coming up. I've got so many birthdays and stuff, and it's not... Like, clubbing outfits for me are just history. I'm into a lot more wholesome kind of things, hanging out with my friends, and I don't really like clubbing as much, so I only go clubbing kind of on the rare occasion. So a lot of things are a bit more dressy, longer, not as, you know, minis with, like, the sexy bodycon dresses, which is a lot of my old hauls, which is really funny, so it's kind of cool that I've kind of, you guys, and you guys probably maturing with me as we go along this together. Don't get me wrong, I love my sexy minis, but I kind of just have a different style now. Let me know if you like any of these dresses, let me know if you get any. A lot of you message me when you use my code, um, which is really, really exciting, it makes me really happy, so let me know what you get. Um, I love when you give like a little haul because as much as I love giving hauls, I love watching them as well. My code is ablister20. Um, that's 20% off. Follow me on Instagram, Abby underscore Lista. I love you all so much, and I'll see you next time. Probably see you on Instagram. Bye.